All right, you know it and I know it. Many of us make New Year resolutions, but let's face it, most of us, we fail. Here to help us stay on track in 2018 is Rochelle Winston. She's going to show us some great yoga poses that will keep us all focused all year long, correct? Yes. All right, Rochelle, I also want to quickly mention, okay. when Lindsay was describing just moments ago earlier in the show that I did, I have done a yoga pose before where you sit on the ground and you put your legs right up on the wall. Yes. Is that actually a yoga pose? It's actually a yoga pose. Ben, you hear that? Yoga pose. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so tell me, because technically I haven't done a full yoga class yet, and many people haven't either. Yep. What makes yoga so beneficial? Right. So in yoga, we set intentions, oh. which really allows us to focus on being happy in our present state, creating these daily positive experiences or right. changes. Whereas New Year's resolutions, we tend to make these big, dramatic changes mm -hmm. that can set us up for failure right. and are often really short-lived. Okay. So we have a couple of poses we're going to try. What's the first one that we're going to be doing? Yes, yeah, so the first pose we're going to do is called... And let's start off easy. We're going to, Very okay. easy. This is very easy. So yeah. we're going to start doing a lotus mudra. Ooh. And a mudra just basically means a hand gesture that stimulates your brain. Okay. So you're going to bring your arms together like this. Like this? Yeah. I'm not, I, I'm not in the best attire, so bear That's with okay. me. That's okay. We'll make it work. Hand. Okay. So you're going to bring your pinkies to touch yeah. and your thumbs to touch. And you're going to fan your fingers wide. So this is the lotus mudra. Okay. And what this does is it's a symbol of purity and perseverance to conquer your fears. So oh. we talk about setting an intention. Yeah. So what you could do at home is you can find a quiet place, just close your eyes, okay. find a comfortable seated position, and then close your eyes, focusing on what it is your intention could be. Or getting rid of your fear. And getting rid of your fear. Heights. I'm, so, I'm, I want to get rid of heights. Well, this And this is what you do? Perfect. You focus on that. So an intention, an example of an intention could be something like, I have a really stressful day coming up. Right. I'm going to stay calm throughout the day. Okay. And That's how long would you hold this for, would you say? You could hold it for five to ten breaths or five to ten minutes if you have the time. Oh. So it'd be like a meditation. This would be good even like before our show. Like this is something you Absolutely. could do at the office or something, right? Absolutely. So if you know yeah. they're going into a really stressful situation, yeah. you, you feel really kind of all over the place, this is great to ground you. So it really okay. just focuses you. Awesome. All right. So what's the next pose? It's a tree pose? Yes. Yeah, so the oh. next pose, we're going to do tree pose, a little variation. Okay. So we're going to balance. You're going to balance on your right leg. Right. So just... Yes. Okay. And then what you can do is you can put your foot right against the ankle. Or, for those who have a little more range of motion, you can bring it all the way up to the upper inner thigh. Okay, and is that better, like, to... It's not better, it's not worse. Okay. It's just different. Right. And then what we're going to do is the variation. We're going to bring our hands behind uh -huh. our back. So two options. You can bring your fists together. Yes. Or you're going to make a reverse prayer. How's that balance going? It's, um, it's, it's happening. It's working. It's yeah. good. Okay, focus. Just, okay. So if you notice, balance poses create focus mentally, and it's physically challenging. Very. So you can't think about anything else except exactly what you're doing. I'm thinking about a lot right now. I'm trying not to yeah. fall. But, yeah. So the whole thing with bringing okay. your hands together like this behind your back in a reverse prayer, you doing yeah. okay? Yeah, I'm just going to just, just take just a break. Relax. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> this Woo. is actually combining or balancing right and left okay. brain. And, and so you hold your hands like this, and you and how mm -hmm. and you say you would hold this for two, three minutes? No, you can hold this for five to ten breaths. Two, three okay. minutes is, is, is like rock star. Super. Yeah. Okay, that wasn't too bad. I think I'm going to try that out and get report back to you in a week, see Amazing. how that one's doing. Perfect. What's our next one? So our next pose, we're going to do a lunge with eagle arms. Okay. So what you're going to do is you're going to step your left leg straight back. All the way back. And I should say you want to do these poses on both right and left side. Okay. Okay, so now I'll, we... I'll keep alternating back and forth with them. Just hold the right side for five, ten breaths. Hold the left side for five to ten breaths. Okay. Okay, so first thing when we do a lunge, we want to make sure our knee is stacked right over our second, third toe or over right. our ankle. Okay, you is want this good? Like That's this? great. Perfect. And you can stay like that if you want, yeah. or you can play with extending your back leg. Okay. Now you can also bring your knee down. For today, let's bring our knee down. Okay. Perfect. I like this. This is nice this and stable. This is good. This yeah. is good. So we're Grounded. opening our hips. We have to get very grounded. Grounding. Yes. Yeah. So now we're going to add in our eagle arms. Okay. So our left arm's going to go here, our right arm's going to go underneath. Okay. We're going to flip our palms up. We're going to give ourselves a high five. Uh oh. Oh, exactly. Okay. Now you want to lift your elbows up just a little bit. Oh, we're a little constrained here. Just a little restrained. Okay. It's okay. Just a bit. Yeah. So from here, you're going to focus and stay here. Yes. Now, the benefits of this is a great stretch, but also, again, we're combining right and left arms. Okay. So it balances right and left brain. Right. Okay. Because one part of the brain is used more than others. Like exactly. Like if you're more creative or... Yes. Okay. So this brings the body back into a state of balance. Again, it creates physical strength, mental focus. Do you also need these mats if you're going to do yoga? Like, can it, you just do it on the ground or...? It's just more protection for the knee. Okay. And it helps to gain a little traction because it's a sticky yoga mat. Okay. You know what? I like this one. Great. What do we call this one again? This is just a lunge with eagle arms. I like the eagle arms. Great. And okay. you can release. And release. Yeah. Ah. And then what's next? What do we do next? You're going to come to stand on the top of your mat. Okay. 
We're gonna bring our feet about hips distance apart. Like this? Perfect. Perfect. And then this is called chair pose or fierce pose. Ooh. So you're gonna start to sit your hips back, like you're hinging at your hips, sitting back into an imaginary chair. Like this? Now what you, yes, exactly. Okay. You wanna focus on that we're not dumping or arching into the low back. So let's pull the tailbone down, draw the navel in towards like your this? spine. It's almost like you're kind of doing a twerk. It's like. Kind of like a twerk. twerk. <laughs> tuck, okay. your tuck your tailbone under. Okay. And then you're gonna reach your arms, your biceps by your ears. Okay. Good, palms face in. Let's look forward. Forward. Good, you can take your arms wider apart if the shoulders are tight. Good. Okay. Can you bring your knees in just a little bit? You want it in more? Your knees in, yeah. Okay, like this? And then let's sit a little deeper. Like deeper? Good, okay. yes. Woo! So this is a huge this? building pose. It's yeah, challenging, Yeah, this one is right? releasing a lot, and I'm feeling a lot of things <laughs> in this one. <laughs> And we can hold this for five seconds? Five to 10 breaths. Okay. Yeah. Do you and want to breathe through these poses? All righty, All right. Rochelle, Always thank you so up. much. You You're have so helped welcome. me be more focused. And I'm going to let you know how this goes. And Amazing. I'm sure our viewers have been doing that a lot as well. Thank you for being here. We appreciate it.